Today I'm unboxing a Saber Shogun lightsaber. So this is going to be a stunt saber and I really don't know all that much about this company. So here's the logo of it, I guess. And I did buy it on eBay. So I think the person I bought it from on eBay is maybe a distributor of this item. Their name's CyberJosh23 and I'll link to them below if you're interested. So let's check it out. I think these are kind of like made in China lightsabers. Um, and it looks like they, the company may only have one type of lightsaber right now, or when I looked on their website, that's kind of what it looked like, that it was just this kind of stunt saber. And there are a few different options uh, for the colors. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, let's get rid of some of this tape. Let's see, I think this blue dot on the bottom may mean that it's blue. We'll find out. Now if I can get these tabs kind of open. And you can see by the size of the box, um, this, this does come with a blade. So it'll be kind of neat to take a look at that blade also. Now these tabs are kind of hard to open sometimes. Might just rip it. <laughs> Okay. That is kind of wedged, you guys. Okay. There's a little bit of a peek at the lightsaber as they tear open the box. Come on. <laughs> okay, it's got some nice foam padding on the inside, and let's see if we can maybe get this out. Just maybe. Okay, cool. We can put the box to the side, and here it is. So we have kind of all of it nested in this kind of foam padding. Here's the lightsaber. We have a blade right here. Yeah. Let's see if we can get the blade out of the foam eventually. Here's the blade. Uh, let's remove the plastic. Seems very strong. It's definitely kind of a heavy grade or a thick walled blade. Let's check out the hilts now. We do have a hex wrench up here. So here is the hilt. It's relatively light. You can see that it's uh, kind of a metallic silver and black. Here's the top. We have some windows in the emitter. And there's the, let's see, got a cover tech wheel on the bottom. Uh, the blue dot <laughs> on the bottom matches. Um, I guess that's so, you know, whoever's fulfilling the orders knows that this is a blue LED. Let's see. This is where the batteries would go. Okay, so we don't have batteries currently. Uh, you know what I'm going to see? I have an old Sabres lightsaber nearby. I'm going to borrow some batteries. It's going to just take a second. Oops. So this should run on AAA batteries. Here we've got a few that I have borrowed <laughs> from an Ultra Sabers lightsaber. And let's add some batteries. Ah, okay, so it takes three. For some reason, I thought it would take four. It takes three batteries. Let's pop that back in. Oh, let's put the Velcro back. Maybe. Eh, you know what? I'm not going to put that back right now. <laughs> this is an unboxing video. We only have so much time. 
Okay, let's see if it turns on. No, it does not turn on, not yet. <laughs> Maybe I should have put... Uh, let's see. I think this is all good. Should be turning on. Uh, da -da -da. Nope, not yet. Okay. I don't know. I'll check the battery pack, you guys, and I'll get back to you. Um, sometimes it's just kind of hard in these unboxing videos. Now it's possible it won't work. It's possible I did something wrong. I've done that before. But here's kind of a first look, at least visually, at the hilt. And it has a pretty cool appearance. Hopefully we can get it to work in uh, an upcoming video. But this is a uh, Sabre, was it Sabre Shogun? Sabre Shogun lightsaber right here. Here's a first look.